simply my two cents and it's time to fulfill a promise I made to my subscribers giveaway time and we'll call it my 187 subscribers appreciation giveaway um, I'm going to give away a knife one of these custom made Eakin knives so stay tuned for details I'm going to show you a couple new blades that were made by Eakin knives go check out his website get a blade have him make one they're the coolest knives ever custom made so you have your own man one of a kind um, these are all kind of a combination of knife styles that I wanted with a little expertise from Eakin Knives helping me out to make some tweaks here and there. Um, but man, he did an awesome job. Um, that's one finish. And I'll show you some more. Stay tuned. Peace. Finally, I get to give something away. I'm excited to do this. Um, first of all, I want to show you some of the new Eakin knives that have that I've had made. Um, this one is codenamed Whiskey. Yes, it's not spelled like the whiskey you would think. That's what this one's called, though one it's got the one on there anyways and on the back side you see the EK for Eakin knives okay this was this is a bad knife guys and gals um, it's got his custom micarta like handles on them the pommel is rough and tough check that out check out the, th the thickness on that bugger now that's a nice blade jimping amazing not overly aggressive that it tears up your thumb a bad knife man um, if you remember some of the ones I reviewed earlier or showed you I haven't really done a full full out review video on them yet I will though I've been compiling some videos on a lot of the outdoor stuff I've been doing so we'll come but I'm doing a giveaway now because I promised one and I need to fulfill. So that's one. Got a got the finger choil there and a great grip from back here. And it's which I'm trying to remember the length of these from from the pommel to the tip of the blade. You're 11 by 11 inches on this one knife and. Your measurement right here is going to be about inch and a half. Is that right? Almost, man, almost two inches. Oh, just shy of two inches. So the that's the, the measurement from here to here. I don't know all the technical details, what you call everything trying to remember but I'm not good at that so um, I'll show you what I'm measuring um, from your handle to the tip of the blade you are about six and a half inches okay there you go full flat grind love full flat grind that thing's a bad knife guys and gals I'm telling you you for uh, 50, 60 bucks, I think is what he's charging for these. You cannot go wrong. This is the sheath, the Kydex sheath that comes with it with the pr same price. And, and great. Um, and he is getting, sheaths are getting, he's getting a lot more practice with them. So they're all, Show you a couple of the other new blades I got. Um, he made a new, a new 
sheath for this knife. That gives you the, it comes out that way. You see that? And it's got a cool little 12 gauge butt snap on it. You see that shotgun shell 12 gauge snap? Pretty sweet. And the knife, this knife is awesome. Sweet. I already showed you this one though. So I'm put that one up. I'll show you a couple of the other new blades. So there's this one that I just showed you. And that's the whiskey one. Uh, this is a new blade that he made. Um, it's a nice little blade on that one. I like it. And that's a, this is a bigger one though. It is from handle to tip of blade is 14 and a half inches. Blade handle from the end of the handle to the end of the tip of the blade is nine and a half inches. Um, just the blade after the choil you're at eight and a half inches. So there's those two blades. Um, another new one is similar without the finger choil on it. Sweet blade. Just check it out. This is the Whiskey Mach 2. It's without the finger choil. I got a little glue on this side. I was just trying to peel off. So that's without your finger choil. Um, again, great jimping. I'm a little bit different blade design there. If you can see those two differences. Bad blade though, guys. Um, another, nope, showed you that one already. Let's see, oh, there it is. No. This one. That one's got the, so, these ones are very similar. This is the Whiskey Mock one. So, very similar. Those two. Full flat grinds. I'm a big fan of the full flat grind. This bigger one didn't have one because we wanted to try something a little bit different for chopping purposes. Um, let's see. Got new, 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 new. Okay, that's the new ones. These are the new knives. This is the uh, one that I showed you last time. Uh, Anyways, these are the new ones. If any of these ones you like, get a hold of him at Eakin Knives. And he will hook you up. Great deal. Um, you can see the different finish on these. Different blades. Um, you got... You can see the difference there. I've just coated them with oil to... I always keep all my knives coated when they're sitting to prevent rust. Um, not that I've had any problems with any of these yet, but it's what I do. I take care of my knives. Okay, so let's probably get to details. So you're probably wondering how do I enter the giveaway? 
it's going to be a drawing and here's what you need to do so pay attention number one you have to be a subscriber to simply my two cents okay once you're a subscriber then you need to send me a check or PayPal amount of $75. Just kidding. You don't have to send me $75. It's a giveaway. Uh, number two, you have to comment in this video. That's number two. Number three, you have to tell me which blade you like the most in your comment. And I'm going to number these ones. One through seven. Number one, you can see that angled blade. Um, the shortest of these, number one. Number two. Number three. Number four. Number five. Number six. And number seven. Okay. Number three and number six are a lot alike. Just so you know. Okay. Number four, you have to tell me if you like making making wooden spoons. That's a yes or no answer. Yep, just tell me if you like making wooden spoons while out in the woods with a little paracord and gorilla tape attached. Tell me if you like to do that. That's a really good idea. Number five. Hmm. Number five, you have to, if you win, wait, that doesn't work. Number five. you have to send me something first that's of equal value and if you don't win I'll send it back no that doesn't work number five you have to send me Your favorite knife. No, that doesn't work. There is no number five. So you have to do one through four because there's no number five. Yeah. So let's review those the numbers, things you have to do to enter this contest. Number one, subscriber. Number two, you have to comment. Number three, you have to tell me which knife you like the best. Number four, the spoon thing. If you like to carve wooden spoons and wrapping it with paracord and putting a little Gorilla tape on the end of it. Number five, 
there is no number five. It's only one through four. Yeah, one through four. Peace. Simply my two cents. And most of all, Merry Christmas. And I hope you have a happy new year. And I hope you enter this contest so you can win a knife. And I do appreciate my subscribers. Um, and please, for your benefit, whether you win one of these or not, go to econknives.com and check out his knives. Give him a call or send him an email. I'll get some prices. Um, refer to any of these knives on this video of knives that you might like to have. They're awesome custom knives. Great steel. Comes sharper than an, any knife I've ever got. He is a master sharpener. So check him out. Um, I've, I'm obvi obviously a big fan of his knives. I've really liked him. And I know you will too. Merry Christmas.